Hey, what's up guys? Welcome to Training Reviews. So I'm pretty excited today. I've got the DJI Phantom 3 standard. So I'm gonna give you a quick overview about what this can do. And then I'm gonna give you a test flight footage for the first time and see how it looks in this open field on this nice hot sunny day. So just to start off, give you a bit about the drone. It weighs in about 1.2 kilograms. It's got a maximum height of 120 meters, which I think is pretty high enough. So you're gonna get some really good aerial shots of your landscape. It can go at about 16 meters per second, which is actually pretty fast. So I'm going to give you some footage about how fast that can go as well. Now it's got an inbuilt GPS, which records the point of takeoff so that once it's gone and when you are ready to land it, it can come back to exactly the same point where it marks as the takeoff point. Also, if you wanted to command it to come back, it's got a live GPS so it comes back to where your remote control is. And also if you lose signal for any reason, then also it comes back to the initial takeoff point as well, which I think is really useful for newcomers, people who've never used this type of technology before, and it's easy so you can prevent yourself from damaging it or getting it lost in trees and so on. The other thing I wanted to mention, it's got automatic flight assistant. So when you put it on the ground and you're ready to take off, it hovers about three meters above the ground when you first turn it on, and then you can start controlling it with the remote control, as well as when you're ready for it to land, it comes back to you and it will land itself, which I think is pretty useful because then you don't have to worry about it crashing, you don't want to damage it in any way, so it does all of the heavy work for you. Also, if you're wanting to just stop the drone, then you can just keep it in position via your mobile phone and it will just hover in place. So no matter how far it is or how high up it is, it will just hover there until it's waiting for your next instruction. So it is really useful. It's, it's very safe in terms of preventing itself from crashing and, and causing human error using the remote controls. So I think that's pretty, pretty cool. Now it's got a gimbal at the bottom. So it's a three axis stabilizer. You've got these stabilizer hinges right there underneath the drone and it creates really smooth footage as well. So you're going to see some sample footage in a second and I'm going to be showing you how good that stabilizer is and how smooth it is running alongside me and just looking at landscape and panning left and right and so on. Right, in terms of the camera that comes with it, it's got a 12 megapixel sensor. It's a 20 millimeter f2.8 aperture lens. It comes with four photo modes, single, burst shooting, auto exposure and time lapse mode. It's got three video modes that you can record on at HD from anywhere up to 24 to 60 frames per second. It's got full HD from 24, 25 to 30 frames per second. And the maximum resolution is 2.7K, which also gives you really good video footage at up to 30 frames per second as well. So I'll be recording that in 2.7K and showing you guys that next. And finally, before you get started, and remember this, this is one of the most important points, is that you have to set it up. So once you get it out of the box, you have to make sure you assemble all of the equipment, make sure you read the user guide to do that, set up all the gimbal and the lenses, and also make sure you download the DJI Go app, connect this to your phone via the Wi-Fi, and overall, I think it will take about two hours to get it ready, so the last thing you have to do before you take it out is, is a mistake that a lot of people make, is they forget to calibrate the drone with your phone. So make sure you do that, and then you're ready to go and fly it. So that's everything I wanted to show you guys. Now let's go ahead and take a look at some of the footage that this can do.
right guys thanks for watching i hope you liked that video so if you did like the phantom 3 then please do give this a thumbs up and i hope you subscribe I've got some really cool videos coming up i'm gonna buy some more dji products which i think you'll like so if you have any comments drop them uh, down below and i will get back to you as soon as possible check out my instagram at trending reviews i'm gonna put some video footage and some other pictures from the drone and you can check them out there and ask me any questions you want other than that thanks for watching guys i'll see you guys next time take care